Hello, my magician, and welcome back from the weekend. Hope you had a nice one. Sunny and hyper, where is my prediction today for the Pisces, the fish of the zodiac? The moon, which focuses our emotions, is now in the sixth house, which means it is one with your body and your lifestyle. The sixth house is the house of lifestyle and health. So your emotions and your body are merged right now. Now, this is the transit where sometimes people can mislicast a dis-ease in their soul, but this is also the transit where you can heal thyself. If you're having a problem with a body part, a hurt ankle, or maybe a hurt anything, focus your love in your heart and send love to that piece of your body. This is a great way. This is how healers actually work, channeling and Reiki and whatnot. It also means you will be emotionally sensitive in your environment. That means you might be sensitive to your cubicle mates at work. You might be sensitive to traffic on the way to work. This is also the house of lifestyle, everywhere we flow and go in life. And this will last for about another 24 hours. Now, zipping around the sun, I'm happy to report we're in chapter three now of Sun in Libra. This month, the Pisces working on trust and intimacy issues, also having major transformations. Now, remember, chapter one is about what's not working. Chapter two is about what can work. And chapter three is about building what should work. There is no ruling planet of the day. So it's time to just kind of own that space. What do I mean by owning? Well, just imagine what kind of boundaries you want. Hold the space for the boundaries you want with your lover, with your boss, with your family, with yourself. That's one we often forget that we sometimes sabotage or betray ourselves and our own boundaries and just hold that space today. Now I've got some good news as well. Mercury, which had retrograded back into Virgo, has now come back into Libra. That means you have your mental faculties to help you process and communicate your boundaries. So in the last two chapters, as you were kind of experimenting with where trust and boundaries should be, you might have not been able to really talk about it or bring it up or say to your boss or lover, hey, that's not cool. But now that Mercury's there, you're going to find you're really sharp and you can communicate what these boundaries are. So if you have to speak up, I definitely encourage that you do. Then lastly, it's Monday. You know what that means. Meditation Monday with Julie Zipper. We've got a new episode of Meditation by vibration. Julie's going to dive deep and give you some meditations, especially with boundaries. And this is covering chapter three of Sun and Libra. All right. That's all I have for the day, Pisces. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So God.